I'm Howard Giblin. I belong to the Inglewood East MSBU. I missed my MSBU meeting today to be here. Because, um, actually, I, I'm really impressed that you sent the cards out to let everybody know that there was this issue. Usually we don't know those things. In any event, I don't like any of these options. I agree with several of the other people. There should be something else. I also agree with several other people in regards to the fact that you the, you need an oversight committee for or something for CCU. They're just nuts. Um, yeah, I was I had some concerns. It says you know uh, these increases, so, but some of them have been answered. So, like six percent for sewer. I'm not on sewer. I. Not yet, in Inglewood East. And I'm thinking, somewhere buried in one of those 119 pages someone was talking about, probably or somewhere else, that you're thinking about raising these rates to put sewers in Inglewood East. And I think it's buried in there somewhere. And um, I can just bet, <laughs> bet it's gonna happen. And, and what am I getting for my extra money? that I'm gonna be spending on, on this. I'm not getting anything more. Water is our most precious resource. Granted, but that doesn't mean we can abuse it monetarily either and rape everybody. You're gonna actually run this area down. People, most of these people, like they say, are on fixed incomes. I'm still one of the working people out there trying to make it single on my own, own my own house. Well, pay a mortgage, the bank owns it. But it's not kept up anymore because I can't afford to keep it up anymore. So it's going to fall apart. You raise the rents and all the other things, then the impact fees and all that other stuff, and these, and you put those sewers in. I can guarantee you, I'll walk away from that house, and you guys, and the banks can hash it out, and I'll retire and live happily ever after. Maybe. Um, thanks for the heads up about the August meeting. Um, I'm a working stiff, so me getting a lot of work on a certain day, even to make it to here, is a hardship. No one's paying me to be here. No one's paying me to be on the MSBU Advisory Board of Inglewood East either. It's a voluntary position. And I know what they did when I complained about that, too, with the 191 paved roads. And Anyway, that bond has been paid off, paid off a year if you looked on the bottom half of your non-ad valorem in that uh, district or whatever. Oh, and that's the other thing, the districts. It says it's uh, District 1, District 2. So that would be Christopher Constance and whoever else is on the districts here. So that means your rates would go up as well, right? Is that correct? Is that what I'm understanding? And Ken Doherty. Because so, you're supposed to be living in, you're supposed to be living in that thing. We had that commissioner that was that issue. I don't know if you're old enough. Get your stuff in so, I mean, your rates would be going up, no? Yes? And anybody else that lives in that district, uh, that's the only ones I could figure out from here. Um, or are you getting something that I don't know about? <laughs> yeah, I just want to know. And then the emergency rate uh, decrease it would be good since we've got two plants now that we're taking care of. Is this an issue? Can we get one done with one of them? Why do we have two? Two plants that we're maintaining? It's kind of nuts. Why? There's inefficiency here. I don't run my business and my jobs, I'm self-employed. If I ran my, I would definitely be on welfare if I ran myself and my jobs that way. Yeah, decrease the emergency rate since you've got this new thing going on here, new wastewater stuff. Um, that man that gave us all those wonderful graphs and charts and how much that cost us he made a lot of assumptions, and you know what the word assume means, I'm sure. If you listen to his verbiage, everything was an assumption. So I want some hard facts, and I need to have an oversight committee for CCU. Thank you. Thank you.